I've been commissioned by 1800 Tequila to create a refined ensemble from raw pieces for the red carpet. I have one more piece to make, which is the coat. The day of the show, there's gonna be lights, a bunch of people. It's very hot. And the heat will be omnipresent. So what's important is that the coat is breathable. I think this may be the hardest fabric for me to find. Most people who do what I do, they have great archives. When I go to flea markets, if I see anything that like I can gain motivation from, I'll pick it up and it usually ends up in one of these boxes of stuff. This Parisian raincoat, double-breasted, heat sealed. And what happens is whenever projects such as this come along, I can then say, I think I have something that I may be actually able to use for an outfit. I found this at a thrift shop. It, it had these numbers on it, like, you know, when a parachute inflates, it has the numbers one, two, three, four, five, all the way around. It. And it said, you know, NASA space program on it. And I was just like, this is at a secondhand shop? Where do parachutes go to die? Like, I never thought about that. It has an amazing breathability because it's a parachute, so naturally it has to breathe. So this is perfect. The robe is one thing. Shawl lapel, all black, has the belt. So what I'm gonna have to do to this is I'm gonna have to take it apart. And after I take it apart, I'm gonna dye each one of these panels. It is my hope that this thing doesn't disintegrate, that it stays together, and that it just takes the color. The people who designed that parachute, I guarantee you had no idea that some 60 years later, it would be used on a red carpet. In finding materials, there's no place that I won't look because you never know when you're gonna find something. At a junkyard, if need be, at a secondhand store, it's great to find beauty in unexpected places. Those little things add a world of value to every single piece. To take something that is raw, and then refine it into something that somebody would wear. There's no better feeling. <laughs>